Hi guys, I'm now uh, I'm in Norway and uh, I'm driving to a hike, a trail which is called Grunsfold Ganga, and it's in Kongsberg. Um, I think it's a well-known trail, so we'll see. Uh, it's about a 10 minutes drive from uh, our cottage that we have rented here, so uh, we'll see. I'll be there in a couple of minutes, I think. I have arrived now. Um, I'm on a parking place. I'm not quite sure if this is the right one. I think so. If we look at the map here, uh, it should be here. It's a bit difficult to find because uh, in Kongsberg there's a brand new tunnel and uh, the navigation actually leads you into the tunnel and says in the middle of the tunnel, this is it. <laughs> and that's not true. So I drove out again and uh, uh, try to avoid the tunnel and I did now um, so let's see if uh, if I can find uh, the beginning of this tour actually I found it finally I followed from the parking place I followed actually the road and then that turns into a gravel road and uh, that leads you to the start of the um, of the trail but you have to be careful because um, you have to follow actually the lead which is mentioned on uh, on the map of uh, all trails because uh, that's where I found the trail because otherwise you can't find it. If you do that, if you'll find it and then finally you get, finally, I mean within a couple of minutes, you come to this sign over here and this one and that's a, a, a very well-known sign and here actually it says Leupe, that's uh, to the right and that's where actually where the trail starts and I think now I can follow these uh, these green uh, signs on uh, on the trees which are uh, very well known uh, in this country yeah, it was mentioned that it is it would be here and there a bit you know I call this always swampy, <laughs> but um, uh, I mean there are bridges or these wooden things over it, so uh, no big deal, right? I already like it. <laughs> it's really the typical Norwegian surroundings here, and uh, these trails are uh, so nice to walk. You know, it's it's always very rocky. And uh, yeah, sometimes it's a uh, strange aestheticism, actually uh, a mild middle one uh, trail, so not too, uh, not too heavy, but also not too easy. Uh, elevation is about 193 meters in this trail, so that's also not so much. <laughs> you see what happened here? Or what happens here? It's closed. And actually, it's, I don't know why, but as it looks like, the whole area here is closed. I don't know how far this goes, but uh, I have to find another way to get around this and uh, hopefully there I can continue the, uh, the route because you know the route is about uh, eight and a half kilometers I'm uh, only 500 meters in it or maybe 500 but between 500 and, and 1000 so uh, a lot to go so let me see if I can get uh, if I can pass this some way it looks like um, that uh, chain over there is gone. So I have to find out if I can get a path to the left and then uh, somewhere get back on, back on track. Um, but this, this one I think leads uh, to the other way, but maybe it will, uh, it will have a, uh, a path to the left somewhere. I'll see, but um, okay, see where I can get. Um, uh, the chain actually was uh, uh, broken somewhere, 
so I passed it and uh, just see where I can get and I just found out that uh, there's a guy bicycling here so if somebody can get here on a bike I think I could should be able to walk here as well um, we'll see uh, I'll also try to get out why this is close I'm uh, back on track again so this is the original route that I wanted to walk um, yeah so uh, let's see how far I can get there you can see a gigantic uh, pile of arms so uh, yeah they are here too see they have a route here Maybe I hope you can see them crawling. That's the route I have. Here too. See? Wow. And that's their home. I mean, it's cloudy, but it's about 20 degrees. And, um, yeah, it uh, really feels uh, fine to walk. There are some mosquitoes here, but I treated myself. <laughs> oh, there's an F-road. <laughs> there's an F-road here. That's odd. Okay. See if I'm still on the right track. That was only a very small part, I think 10 meters or so on that uh, F road. But now I'm back on trail. Yeah. Um, here in Viken, the province in, uh, in Norway, uh, the path, the, actually the hikes, the trails which are here are mostly in the woods and it's really fantastic. You get to all kind of different, um, all kind different, uh, of different uh, trees and, and branches and, and yeah, surroundings, I mean uh, it's really exciting. Uh, it mostly does not lead you to a wow scene, you know, that you get somewhere and say, wow, never seen this before. That's not uh, actually also not the purpose of these trails. Okay. All right. Kongsberg is a well-known ski center here in uh, Norway. Um, they've got some nice tracks. I've been there during winter and did some skiing a couple of years ago. Um, that's actually on the other side of the river. Probably this will lead me to the middle part of the trail and there actually it turns back. It's a bit of a loop and uh, I think the two tracks are quite near to each other. I'm halfway now. This is exactly the middle part of the track. I'm here on a uh, F-road again. And, uh, yeah, <laughs> that's the way I need to go. I uh, just talked to a nice lady who had a cabin over there. 
and I asked her um, why this is closed, you know, if I was able to walk here, because it was a bit scary, you know. And then she said, oh yes, don't worry, this, uh, there is cattle all over the places here, in the woods, there's all, everywhere cattle, and um, they have those things closed with electricity on it to keep the cattle away. <laughs> oh my God. So I, actually the first I saw, I could have passed already, but okay, doesn't matter. I found a nice, I found a nice spot actually to uh, take a break. Sandwich, which uh, a little baguette, lots of cheese on it, so that's good. And uh, yeah, and some drinks, or well, water. But that's okay. Go back on track again. Um, Yeah, 4.5, maybe 5 kilometers to go. It could take me um, one hour and a half or so, I think. I, uh, yeah, I mentioned tour, by the way, because here in Norway, they call this tour. The trail is tour in Norwegian, and uh, it's uh, most of them, at least, are marked with a T, a big, a big red T, on the trees, on the rocks, or everywhere. And then you can follow the tour. <coughs> Sorry, this tour, by the way, is not marked at all. So you really have to follow uh, on Google Maps. The, um, uh, the tour, which is marked by all trails. Little part on the F road again. And off the F road again. On track. It rains now. <clears throat> A little bit, but it rains. Yeah, thanks for watching again, and uh, see you on the next hike with Miklukski.